there's nothing wrong with dedicating your child to the Lord. Amen? Amen. 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 I said, there's nothing wrong with dedicating your child yeah. unto the Lord because you want God to take control of his life. Amen. Amen. Let me get this right. Amen. Because this thing just keeps. Amen. You can have this world good. Somebody better say yes. And I'm telling you, y'all can turn those microphones off for me. You can have this world good. And God is so good and wonderful. Amen. And we need to serve him. Can you turn that speaker a little bit to your. Turn that speaker right there, please. Just a little bit away from me. Uh huh. Yes, thank you. Amen. I, I tell you, God is so good and he's just wonderful. Amen. 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 So in 1 Samuel, I just want to read in 1 and 28. Amen. When Hannah asked the Lord, she asked God for a child. Uh -huh. Amen. Yeah. And she said, you know, as soon as God give me this child, she said, Lord, I'm going to get him, get him back to you. Because she knew that it was a miracle that she asked God for. Amen. She couldn't have no children. But she was in the temple praying and asking God, Lord, give me a son. Give me a child. Give me a child. She didn't care if it was a boy or a son or a daughter. Amen. She just wanted a child. Amen. And God gave her exactly what she asked for. So she said this. She said, so I have dedicated him to the Lord. As long as he lived, he is dedicated to the Lord, and he worshiped the Lord there. So listen, when you learn how to worship God there, where you are, y'all better say something up here. <laughs> and when you acknowledge that you didn't have this baby by yourself, come on somebody, but you acknowledge that God has given you this child, and you want to give this child and dedicate this child, as the scripture would say, lit to the Lord. Lit means to dedicate, uh, give it for a certain period of time. Yeah. So, but let me tell you something. Each and everybody that I'm getting ready to call the parents down. I know Theron's supposed to be getting his child dedicated, so we're going to call them down for it. And let me tell you this. It's up, parents, and I'm going to tell you, you've got a great and a dynamic responsibility. Listen to me to every parent that's in here. Your responsibility as you give that child to the Lord is up to me to raise this child in the way of God, in the way of the scriptures, in the way of knowing what God's way is. Amen? Amen. And if that's your responsibility, it's the responsibility of the parents, it's the responsibility of the grandparents, it's the responsibility of the aunties, the aunts, the uncles, amen. And also, it's the responsibility of the church to live a life in front of that child. Come on, somebody. Amen. That you can also say, you know what? This is a beautiful child. It takes a valley. What? To raise children? Come on. Amen. To raise a child. Amen. All of us have to take responsibility. Amen. To raise that child. Amen. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to have the parents of the Corey, Malik Jones, to come. Amen. And stand right here in front of me. And you can bring the baby with you too. And the grandparents, Ellen, i have to come and stand on the side of them. Because y'all are responsible too. Amen. Amen. So is the two babies I'm dedicating? Uh-uh. Yes, yes. Okay, okay. Who's more her dedicated? Yeah, okay, that's another <laughs> Okay, who's, okay. All right, I'm just, you know, y'all like to keep me straight when I listen. <laughs> we just thank God for children. Children are beautiful. I look at Ellen and Brother Deacon Blackwell that's standing up here. Amen. This is her daughter. Amen. And this is her father. Amen. Amen. And we just want everybody to know that it's a responsibility for us as a church family to stand behind them that's standing right here. Everybody that's standing up right here. Amen. Did you ever get dedicated? Did she? she I thought, okay. I just want, you know, I'm going to dedicate my baby up in here. Ariane, where is Ariane? Come in one second and get this all for me. 
Amen. Let me tell you, as I it was thinking about, amen, just pull me up a little bit. That's another situation. All it is, y'all, that we believe in dedicated children to the Lord, back unto the Lord, because it's our responsibility. Amen. But just to let you know, I just wanted you to stay right there for me. Amen. Just to let you know, I just wanted to let you um, to Corey names as a created name. Just a created name. Okay, I thought you would find they called us closest name or two of us. J A C O R Y. His name is J A C K O R I. Which means that it's a male. Amen. And um it's a created name. And also Malik, that name, Malik, as I look for the meaning of that name, it's Arabic and it means king. Come on. That that means y'all y'all gonna make me throw this microphone. Listen. A king, which means that that young boy is going to be a leader one day. Somebody better say amen. amen. So those names mean something, y'all. So we're going to ask the Lord to make this young man the leader that he's supposed to be. As we give him back unto the Lord. Amen. Amen. If he let me hold him. Come on. Come on. Come on down. <laughs> I'm going to knock this favor in the name of the Lord. Amen. And we're dedicating this favor unto God. Wow. That God's hands would be on this child yes. all the days of his life. Yes. But I'm speaking and prophesying mm -hmm. over this child that this child is going to be a leader. Mm -hmm. A powerful leader in God. Amen. Somebody better say amen. amen. Successful in the world and in the church. Y'all don't want to shout up in here. But that name Came oh. up my lead as a king. Yes, yes Lord. Oh, yes. God, I anoint this baby in the name of the Father and Son of the Holy Ghost, oh, yes. of the Spirit of the Lord. God, I ask you in the name of Jesus as I dedicate this beautiful son unto you, God. Oh, God, I ask you to use him for your glory. Yes. Yes. Send a guardian an angel to protect him yes. all the days of his life, Lord yes. God. God, I prophesy. And I speak him as a king and a leader in this world, spiritually and physically. Give him the wisdom and the knowledge and the understanding yes. to be successful in life all the days of his life. Yes. In Jesus' name I pray. Yes. And God, I pray over the parents yes. as I'm dedicating them to the Lord. Yes. That they need to raise this child up yes. in the way of God. And God, I give you all the honor and the glory and the praise. I pray yeah. for the grandparents. Yeah. Touch yeah. them, Lord. Yeah. Oh, God, his sister. Oh, God, touch them in the name of Jesus. Yeah. Lord, I ask you to give them all the wisdom to rear this child up in the admonition of the Lord. Yeah. And God, we give you all the honor and the glory and the praise yeah. as I plead the blood of Jesus over this son, yeah. as I dedicate him unto you, God. Yeah. In Jesus' name I pray. Yeah. Amen. 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 That's a beautiful thing. Amen. I'm going to push it in the name of the Lord, in the name of the Lord, in the name of the Lord. Amen. In the name of the Lord, in the name of the Lord. That's a beautiful thing. We give God the honor and the praise. Hallelujah. 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 You may be seated. Hallelujah. That's a beautiful thing, you know. God is real and God is good. Amen. 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 So we're gonna sing a couple more songs. The other people are not here. Amen. And we just got to move on. I may do it at the end of the service. Amen. But God is so wonderful and just an awesome God. Amen. Amen. I asked the Amen the praise team. Amen. The singing choir, praise choir, whatever y'all want to call. Amen. To come back. Amen. And